Hello, this is Adam Fisher with ExploreFinancialFreedom.com. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. We want to get these videos out to more people. So please like and subscribe to this channel. We would greatly appreciate it. We make these videos to elevate strategies to see people live free. That's really what ExploreFinancialFreedom.com is all about. We want to help people become free and live the life they have always dreamed of. And so we really try to elevate strategies to see you uh, become financially free and become sovereign over your own life. Um, today, I really wanna talk about inflation. What is inflation? What is inflation? Well, uh, really the, the easiest way to describe inflation is whenever central banks print massive amounts of money, whenever they print massive amount of money, and they create more money, what that does is more money goes into the system. When more money goes into the system, uh, it devalues your currency. When it devalues the currency, consumer prices rise. And so really that's what inflation is. Central banks create more money, more money goes into the system, it devalues the currency, and consumer prices rise. That is what inflation is. Now, why is inflation occurring throughout the United States and really all over the world? But I'm gonna focus on the United States. Uh, why is it happening? It's happening because the Federal Reserve, which is a central bank, it did just what inflation does. They printed money. They printed money, they printed a massive, they printed a massive amount of money. Um, during COVID. Now, why did they do that? Well, there's a lot of different reasons for why that happened. But really, in my opinion, this is just my opinion, they artificially had to stimulate the economy. We were already entering into a recession. We were already seeing a massive correction as early as the fall of 2019 into March of 2020. And so COVID hits, we see we, in, like I said, we saw the correction already uh, pre-COVID, uh, but really from fall of 19 to March of 2020, we're seeing a correction. COVID hits. They start um, printing money. And what happens is the federal government took that money and created stimulus programs. The stimulus programs artificially kept the economy going. But now that those stimulus packages are done, what we're really seeing is now the prices are going up and inflation is on the rise. And I would argue inflation is ab abusive to the poor and middle class. Um, it is, it harms the poor, it harms the middle class, um, and it's just, it's just abusive to, to that group of people. Um, and the only way they can fix it is to really what they call monetary tightening and they have to tighten the money supply which means they have to raise interest rates um, but raising interest rates brings its own problems because if they raise interest rates that's really going to impact big businesses on wall street it's going to impact banking there's just a lot of factors to that and so uh, really what we're looking at is the fed the federal reserve has two options they can raise interest rates and just possibly destroy the market, or they can go back to where they were and continue to print money and really destroy their currency. Um, neither option is great, but, um, but one is more disastrous. And I would argue that destroying your currency uh, is more disastrous. If you would like to learn more about inflation, more about topics um, relating to financial education and how to become financially free, please check out our website, explorefinancialfreedom.com. We're always trying to put resources on that website, um, free resources that you can watch, read in order to learn and educate yourself. So please check out our website, explorefinancialfreedom.com. Again, check out the website, explorefinancialfreedom.com. And thank you for checking out today's vlog today.